launch point. We brought along a dog this time. Hey, Harley, what do you think? You want an adventure? Today's adventure begins in Nopaming Provincial Park. Northeast of Lac de Bonnie, just past Bird River, on Provincial Road 315, is the entrance to the park. Just past Shoe Lake, you reach a creek that meets the road. This is the launch point to Coal, Coal Lake. Lake. Headed out on Rabbit River. Go left! I'm trying! <laughs> up quick on the left is a creek that leads to another lake, and is a great destination for a family trip. Quick short one, hey Harley? Straight out. All the portages on this trip are roughly the same distance and not too long. The paddle early on has some shallow sections that may be a little tough with low water levels. Second portage coming up. This one seemed to be one of the tougher portages. Not too bad, and it was nice to keep moving in the cold weather we had. Second portage. We had a lot of loading and unloading of the canoe to do, but we kept moving to reach the lake to set up camp before dark. Altogether, there are six portages on this canoe route, with a few campsites as you head down Rabbit River. Charge number five! <laughs> After all the hard work, we were excited to get to some fishing, but it seemed like it was gonna take forever. Ever. Ever. Last portage, I think. Last portage. We had finally reached the lake. Got our first fish in Coal Lake. Ooh, ooh he's going. Let's get him back up. Uh, where are you going, buddy? There he is. You're good looking. Oh, he's like blue. Yeah, he looks blue. Oh, I came off. The fish we were catching seemed to be a bit darker in color. And apparently blue. Time to find camp. End of the day rainbow. All right, we found camp. Made it to Coal Lake. It's gonna be our spot for the evenings. All our gear. Look at this spot. Nice spot for a tent there. Fire pit. There we go. Chopping up some walleye. And with that, after a long 15 kilometer paddle, six portages, it was time to hit the hay. <laughs> Just heading to the lookout this morning. Beautiful out. It was uh, a mighty cold night. I think probably getting close to zero degrees, I think, but we made it through it. Sun's out. Uh, we spent all day yesterday fishing. Not much luck, a couple jack, but that's about it. Until we got back to the campsite, and then we hit the spot. Bunch of walleye, kept reeling them in. We couldn't keep up. So, we're gonna see if we can find another school today. We're gonna warm up first. Let me play with my dog. Hey Harley, what do you think? Should do that? Yeah, let's do that. All right, I'm gonna stay here another night. Had some fun with Harley, all warmed up, and it was time to explore the lake. Great Canadian Shield. The Canadian Shield is among one of the oldest on Earth and is the largest mass of exposed Precambrian rock, extending 8 million square kilometers. Fact! We kept on exploring and fishing. We started our way back to camp knowing that when the sun began to go down, that the walleye would come out to feed. 
And here's our catch of pike and pickerel. Too bad we decided to fill out our catch during bug hour. Another gorgeous morning, and Harley was having a hard time getting us to leave. Said bye to the lake, and a bald eagle began to show us the way home. On our way back, done one portage. Oh, I can hear the next one. Let's speed this up. Pretty neat. There's Bald Eagle. What? He is leading us home. Yeah. Incredible. All right, two done. Got four more to go. It's truly an amazing paddle and worth the effort if you enjoy the wild like we do. We made it through portage number three. I believe we got three more to go. Hey, one more over this? <laughs> Having our water shoes with us, Whee! we decided to try and cheat our way through a few portages and lifted our canoe over the rushing water. Wait for me! Wouldn't recommend this, because the last thing you would want is a hole in your canoe. And to be stuck in the park, in the middle of nowhere. With dinosaurs. Da, 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 da. Snapping the turtlesaurus. Well, we made it to the last stretch. It's just a little little ways in, through this marsh. But uh, we're almost done. Well, that was an awesome trip. Awesome trip. Approved. Came and got our fill of fish and love this trip to Coal Lake. Lake.